salt inside. Yeah. Yeah. Make milk. Yes, it's a fresh start, fresh day. Awesome weather. Not really sunny, not really cold. Yes, I drove all the way from my house to come and see Ralph Owen. Yes, yeah, so Ralph Owen is from Ohio, United States. This is the first time in Ghana. And he chased up on me and I had to pick him up and bring him in and all that. So today, he want to see a little bit of the sea. Uh, the beaches, you know, go to the uh, supermarket, get some few stuff. So whilst we drove from his hotel, just one minute we found coconut. And he was like, hey, Echo, I want to try the coconut. We need to do the coconut, right? Huh? You love coconut? I love coconut. Yeah. <laughs> Good. I'll, I'll get that no, no right out yeah. and make the milk. Mm -hmm. Oh, man, I'm in paradise. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You want another one? That's where I, I ain't no way I could just drink one. These yeah. things like glazed potato chips, yeah. you can't just do one. Yeah, I don't know. One. one more. Bob, you, 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 you don't want to stop in it. You don't want to stop in it. Yeah, sure. yeah, I'll do. And then to check, turn them on the first one. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. So you have to finish this one, then we we'll start another one. Okay. Hey, guess what? I think I need to start uh, something for our old comrade, you know, for our older brothers and sisters who want to come to Ghana. What do you think? Because uh, most of you come without knowing anybody. And I'm a gentleman. I'm always moving around and stuff like that. So I was thinking, hey, why don't I? I it just came into mind. Echo, you can set up something like just, just maybe get like five young ladies or women and uh, who are like really focused and you know put them into an, a, like i don't know a group because while he's here um he needs to find food to eat he needs to wash he needs to do this and do this and do that so if i have an organization where i have some ladies matured ladies who will be able to wash and cook and serve you know it's like caretaking for our older uh brothers and sisters who want to come to the motherland what do you think anyway that You shopping? Yeah. Got to find <laughs> some good juice. Yeah. It's calico. It's really nice. Like a lot of kids like to take that. A call Simpson, connecting Africans in the diaspora to the motherland. Uh, Ralph Owen. Me, yeah, he's Ralph Owen. Okay. So he came just yesterday from the US. Right. So he's lodging at uh, Ampabia Hotel. Okay, okay, yeah, just so, by us. Yeah, just by you. So yeah, yeah. we'll be coming around to you know talk to you. And, and... Hey, so yeah, on our way in shopping, we met Byron. You already know Byron, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. He's he's the chief executive of our civil Pan Africa. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, so after walking around, doing some shopping, walking around, we found ourselves in Chapel Square. So Chapel Square has a Methodist church. That is a Methodist, this one. This is a Wesley Methodist Church, okay. and then there's another church there. It's an Anglican church. Okay. Yeah. So we call this place Chapel Square. 
Chapel Square. Square. Yeah, so we have a lot of events, like most events are, are done just at this forecourt. Okay. Yes, and this is a historic park called Atu Austin. This one. Yeah, yeah to Austin. Historically, he's uh, one of the people from Central Region okay. who made, you know, some developmental projects when he, he was alive. Yeah. Yes, so, and it's a park, so they do events over there. Okay. All right. They got something going on now. Yeah, yeah, it's a funeral. So, this is what happened. Every weekend, there's a funeral in, in somewhere. Okay. Every weekend. Every but we bury our dead during the weekend. Okay. We we do the, the funeral rites and everything only on weekend. So most weekend you see people dress like that. Okay. You know, like that. Yeah, yeah. attending funerals and all. Yeah. 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 Chapel Square. Yeah, so we here. Um, when it comes to Cape Coast, you need a place to eat. There's one place I will recommend. There are a list of them, but I recommend uh, a place called Sahara. So this is Sahara. On weekends, this place is on fire. I wanted to ask a question before we start eating. Go ahead. Tell me a little bit about Ohio. I mean, culturally, religiously, anything that somebody who is watching want to know about Ohio. Ohio, uh, culturally, um, we like the, uh, the summertime, the um, barbecuing, picnic, cooks out, that's what we call them and stuff, you know. It's a, it's a sports town, it's a football, Ohio is a football uh, town. Um, Canton, Ohio, that's where the Football Hall of Fame is. Uh, and this time of the year, Christmas is big. It's uh, big in Ohio? Yeah, it's big. Christmas is big. Real oh, big, wow. okay, in Ohio. It's just cold, but other than that, uh, it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. I don't know, is it is that where Obama comes from? No, Obama is out of Chicago area, Chicago. Illinois. Illinois. Illinois, Illinois, okay. okay. Yes. Okay. okay. And then you said today when we went out, I was cooking you in the, in, in the car. Is it hot? It's extremely hot for December. <laughs> I had just left a little blizzard, you know, I was thinking to get out of Ohio without experiencing winter. Not so. It said, <laughs> the weather said, not so fast, I got something for you. Yeah. Gave me a couple of days of winter. Yeah. Yes. But it's okay, I mean, day in, day out, you get to enjoy it, and then you get adjusted to it. So yeah. you'll be fine. Oh, I, I believe so. Mm -hmm. I believe so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Everybody else surviving here. Mm -hmm. uh, it to uh, withstand the heat, yeah. just take time. Yeah. You know, everybody gets it. most of the people I see, they're not even sweating. Yeah, <laughs> but I am. Yeah, you're sweating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like that. It's like that. Certain certain places are really different. Mm. You know, but but even even in the south, it's hot like this. You feel it's hot. When you go to the north, you can't even come out. You've been in the room like all day with AC. You talking about the south of Ghana? Yeah, we are in the south of Ghana okay, now. But, but when north you go to is the a north, little cooler? No. Hot. Hot. Hotter than where you are feeling right now. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. But we will go there since, yo, my daddy said, Echo, I'm on vacation. I'm not looking for work. So we're going <laughs> to travel. <laughs> That's what it is. So when you come to Ghana, make sure that, hey, you, you have an open mind. I love, honestly, I love how you are taking it. You know, some people would have been complaining, this, 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 this. But so There's far no as you made up your mind, mm -hmm. if something is not quite right, mm -hmm. then brainstorm with the people that you associated right. with right. and fix it. That's what it is. That's what it is, you know. Yeah. Too much energy complaining. I can use that energy. All right. So I was asking your date of birth, and then you were like 24th October 1950. Yeah. So when I checked from Google, it is Tuesday. And in Ghana, we give names according to the day you were born. What's my name then? Yeah. Then, so now your name is, Tuesday is Kwapna. Kwapna? Yeah, Kwapna. Kwapna? Yeah, Kwapna. Kwapna. K-W-A, Kwa. Kwa. Then B-E. Kwa. 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 Na. Na. Yeah, Kwapna. Kwapna. Yes. Kwapna. Kwapna. 
Kwapena. Kwapena. So now you are called Kwapena. Kwapena. Yeah. So for us to show respect, we will say Uncle Kwapena. Uncle Kwapena. Yes. So uncle like an uncle. Yeah. And then Kwapena. So uncle Kwapena. So hey, welcome uncle Kwapena. Thank you. I got a new name. Yes. Uh, uh, uncle Kwapena. Kwapena. Yes. Kwapena. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Uncle Kobina is right here in Cape Coast and we are chilling. Yes, we yes. are we are about to eat. You know, we're just learning each other's culture. He's telling me about Ohio and me telling him about Ghana, Cape Coast and how we get our name. So since you are born on Tuesday, like I said, you are Kwapina. 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 And I was born on Thursday. So I am Yao. Yeah. Yao. Which day were you born? Uh, Saturday. Kwame. Saturday, so you are what? Kwame. 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 Yes. Kwame. So that is how it works. Okay. All right. Uncle Kwabana, what are you eating? Jollof? Yeah, jollof. Jollof rice. Yeah, yeah with fish. Uh huh. Fish. Yes. Yeah. So it's this is your first time taking jollof? Yes. Ghanaian jollof. Okay. Yes. You go ahead and let's see how it tastes at the end of the day. This is just right. <laughs> very, very good. Really? Yeah. Yeah, there's always been a, a, a competition between Ghana Jollof and Nigerian Jollof. Nigerian think they got the best, yeah, and they Ghana they, think they yes, got the best. But Ghana got the best. Ghana <laughs> got the best. Yes. This is good. Nigeria, I haven't had yours, but you better step it up. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Okay, so I want you to open this. I can open no, it. No, you open it because I open it for you. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, I'm I'm like sometimes when I sit back and I watch my dad, uh -huh. my dad is your age, 73. Yeah. And I and I watch him do stuff like this, and I'm like, I'm gonna get there. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get there. And is it is it scary? No, it's not scary because uh we have young bucks around us. Okay. You know that when we was your age and stuff, we do a lot of things that we can't do now. Mm -hmm. You're around me, so if I can't do it, yeah. the young buck's been brought up. Yeah. Grab that ball up, open that water for the, the elders for and the stuff, elders. you know. If I run into someone, they could be like 60 years old and I'm 73. And I see they can't do something mm -hmm. that they maybe was able to do 20 years ago, mm -hmm. I'll do it. Okay. I'll do it, okay. you know. And that's gonna lead y'all to be the same way because I'm setting the example. Example. Yeah. yeah. Hey, I'm gonna make sure he meets my dad. <laughs> if not today, uh, within the week. I'm not going to work. Yeah, you're not going to work. You keep saying that. <laughs> he keeps saying that, Echo. I didn't come here to work. I'm, I, I'm, I'm here. To, I'm yeah. on vacation. I say that when I retired at. Uh, I was 63. I said, I'm retired. I'm not going to do nothing. I think it's in my DNA mm -hmm. that I should work till I'm dead. Okay? Mm -hmm. Because the time I retired, I went to work. Okay. I got another job. I worked it for another 10 years and stuff. What? Yeah, I did. Another 10 years? I, I worked another 10 years. And then when I stopped saying, I'm not going to work no more, the work I was doing, I was still doing it. I just said, you don't have to pay me. Oh, okay. Because you love it. You love I it. I love it. Doing. What was people calling me? <laughs> One, two, three, two, three. What? what did I say? What did you say? I've got what? Hey, Echo need about four phones. Uh -huh. One for pictures. Uh -huh. One for this area of people that call me. One for the other area of people that call me. <laughs> hey, what's good? So we are at the beach oh, right now. We're having a good time. Yeah, we're having a good time. So. After roaming in town, we decided to come having a good time right now. Yes. How are you feeling the beach? I love the beach. It's everything I've seen, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. In the YouTube videos. Yes. Yeah. Nice water. water. I done found me a place I could fish at. Yeah. And I got up here. I was told I didn't have a pier, <laughs> but I got up here. You got up here. Yeah. Uh,
things that I need to do. All right, let's go. No, take pictures of your people. Nicole Simpson, connecting Africans in the diaspora. What's going on? What's going on? Ah, there's nothing going on. I'm enjoying the scenery, enjoying all the people out here having a good time, dancing and stuff. You ain't gonna get no better than this. I'm in the Cape Coast, enjoying the scenery, watching the young ladies dancing and everything, having a good time. This is Saturday, their off day. They don't work on the day, it's all a day of celebration. Everybody out here is having a very good time. Everybody's having a good time. I am too, I am too. Extremely proud. I already knew I was going to be happy before I got here because I had been here before on YouTube. And it's just everything I did. Brother, is it all right if I put y'all in the picture? I want to send them back home. Let them know that we're alive and well and we're kicking high. <laughs> we're from the motherland. Uh, yeah, I watch YouTube all the time. That's why I'm here. I watch too much YouTube. Okay. Yeah. We're on the Cape Coast, Ohio. I know y'all freezing back there, but it's so hot. Not everywhere I go, I'm looking for a fan. Yeah, yeah, ain't nothing wrong with that. They just made it illegal in Ohio December the 7th. Yeah. My name is... On the beach of the Cape Coast, watching the people enjoy themselves. My people still look good when they having a good time. They're sitting back and enjoying the uh, breeze out here sitting on the ocean. They can't get no better than that, man. No. Shout out. Okay, just give a shout out to all my cosmates. You know, she has some. I'm giving some. So we spent the whole day uh, with uh, my senior comrade, 
from Ohio, United States. Mr. Owen, yeah. you good? Yeah. All right. All right, so we went out chilling. At, uh, I mean, where, like, we would call it like a ghetto. It is not a ghetto, but like, you know, where everything goes down. So we went there, sit there for a while, you know, talk to the people, hang out with the people, chill with the people. And this is what it is, man, Charlie. 